An indigenous artist whose work features Diné female superheroes is being showcased in Albuquerque. News 13's Annalisa Pardo talked to the artist and shows you what has people excited. Drawing since he was little. That was probably my, my main passion. Sean Biel has always loved art. Yeah, I grew up on the Navajo reservation, so I didn't have running water or electricity. And so for me, and this is like before the internet and YouTube and all that. After graduating from Farmington High School and an art institute in Santa Fe, he merged his love for art with his other love, comic books. I like the, the art, but also I think I like the, the mythology behind like especially superheroes. It kind of reminded me of um, our traditional stories. As an artist, BL now creates his own comic characters that feature strong native women. I think they're marginalized or they're not shown appreciation for all the things they do. So for me, I see a lot of them, they are superheroes. With characters like Ayla the Monster Slayer, who fights creatures in a post-apocalyptic Southwest. She's going to protect the people, but she's also going to, I want her to inspire people to, you know, Revive the land. BL's work is a reflection of his life motto, empowerment by art. Art. You want to be empowered, do art. It doesn't have to be drawing. It could be anything. His work has been shown throughout the U.S. and Canada and will now be showcased in the Testament of Empowerment exhibit starting this week at the Indian Pueblo Cultural Center. He hopes visitors are inspired to find their own superhero within. Believe in themselves, you know, empowerment. Annalisa Pardo, KRQE. I believe we can all change the world slowly, but no one person can change the world by themselves. News 13. Some good stuff. The Testament of Empowerment exhibit opens tomorrow at the IPCC's Artist Circle Gallery at 5 p.m. It will run through October 10th.